Fast or Focus Assessment with Sonography for Trauma is a point-of-care ultrasonography technique used in the evaluation of trauma patients. It's a rapid and non-invasive imaging method that aims to identify the presence of free fluid in the abdomen or thorax, which can indicate internal bleeding or organ injury. The technique has found some utility in non-traumatic settings as well. The recommended order for evaluating organs is typically started with right upper quadrant area, where we can detect the liver and right kidney. The physician looks for any sign of disruption, laceration and hematoma. In this patient, there is no sign of hematoma or laceration in liver, but you can see a big cyst form in the right kidney. After assessing the right upper quadrant, move on to the left upper quadrant to examine the spleen and left kidney. Evaluate for splenic and kidney injuries, such as parenchymal disruption, hematoma, or laceration. As you can see, there is no sign of fluid accumulation, laceration, or disruption in the left kidney and spleen. Then we can try to find gallbladder. Position the ultrasound probe in the right upper quadrant of the abdomen where the gallbladder is anatomically located. Place the probe just below the ribcage in the midclavicular line or slightly anterior to that. Initially, orient the probe in a transverse plane to obtain an overview of the right upper quadrant. Identify the liver which appears as a hyperechoic or bright structure above the gallbladder. Look for a pear-shaped structure located beneath the liver in the right upper quadrant. The gallbladder may appear as an anechoic or black or hyperechoic or darker structure depending on the presence of bile or sludge. Examination of the aorta is not a standard component of the FAST protocol, but we can assess it if it's needed. For detecting the aorta, choose a low-frequency curvilinear or phase array probe to penetrate deeper structures. Start by placing the probe in the epigastric region just above the umbilicus and slightly to the left of the midline. The aorta typically appears as a hypoechoic or darker circular structure with bright reflections from the posterior wall. Utilize color or spectral Doppler to confirm blood flow within the aorta. Assess for normal blood flow pattern and rule out any stenosis, occlusion or dissection. While the heart and valves are not typically included in the standard FAST protocol, it is possible to visualize certain aspects of the heart incidentally during a subxiphoid or precardial area scan. Position the ultrasound probe in the subxiphoid or pericardial area, just below the xiphoid process and slightly to the left of the midline. Orient the probe in a sagittal or longitudinal plane. Observe the cardiac chambers, including the right ventricle, left ventricle, and atria. Pay attention to the pericardial space surrounding the heart for the detection of pericardial effusion, which may appear as anechoic or black fluid that we cannot see in this patient. While visualizing the heart, you may be able to identify the cardiac valve incidentally. Observe the mitral valve between the left atrium and left ventricle, and the tricuspid valve between the right atrium and right ventricle. It may be challenging to visualize the valve directly, but their function can be indirectly assessed by observing the flow of blood across them using color Doppler.